Hey guys, it's Gray. Um, I have a tutorial for you on GIMP today um, that's going to show you how to make a body figure look more attractive or appealing, um, and how to move around a body figure in a 2D situation. So I went online and I found this picture of this model. I'm going to right click and copy this image edit and then paste and uh, this is really not a great example but um, I couldn't really find anything better than this um, we're gonna go to image and we're gonna size the canvas up so we don't run into her elbows or anything like that and we're gonna hit center and resize so we just resized it a little bit actually we're just gonna resize it a little bit more than that we're gonna sample this color using the color sample tool and make this layer to the image size and fill it. So we've just made the image a little bit bigger. <clears throat> okay, so now we're ready to go to filters, distort, and eye warp. And this is basically a tool where you can move around the image, mix it around and stuff. Um, so yeah, we're gonna start moving around stuff to make it look slimmer. I'm gonna make my deform radius around 50 start moving in everything to make it just look slimmer and smaller. Um, you want to bring in this part of the body more, bring in this part of the body, um, bring in her legs, bring in head, Bring in everything like this. Okay, let me restart that because it wasn't looking so good. You have to keep trying. Like I said, this isn't a very good example, so it's going to be a little bit difficult to get my point across into what I'm trying to talk about. But you want to move in, that kind of stuff. Size down your deform radius to get details out like this. Kind of suggestive, isn't it? Anyway. Keep moving in your details. You want to exaggerate every curve. Then you move up your de default a lot and start moving in a lot of the stuff. Oh crap, I almost messed that up. This is a great tool to just mess with things and see if you can get a better um, result. So I'm going to try to fix up some more stuff. And then finish up here. Okay, so this is not a good example, but um, as you can see here, it looks a lot more slimmer than this did. So she looks a lot more pudgy there than she does there. So this is just a real quick tutorial just to show you guys the eye warp tool um, and how it can change different people's look and everything. Um, I might do a more in-depth tutorial on iWarp um, with a better example than this. But yeah, guys, that's basically it. Um, stay tuned for new updates, tutorials, and um, yeah. If you guys are interested in the game dev that I'm doing, um, the game development, the game development that I'm doing, um, here's a link right here. So check it out. And um, yeah, so. I'll see you guys later. Thanks a lot for watching.